Tones, what is going on y'all? I hope y'all are well and in awesome, awesome health. If you're new right here, I'm gonna tell you who I am just a little bit. I am Jaren, I am a voice teacher, speech trainer, and the founder and the owner of this marvelous studio, the Jaren M. Luger Studio. I actually wasn't planning on doing this video, but I saw this pop up, I'm recommended, recommended. <laughs> Our recommended videos and I said let me hear what's going on as I always say in my videos this is more so an analysis not a reaction so I'm gonna start and stop a lot to talk about what's going on so if you don't like starting to stop a lot in videos and talking through the video then go on to another video because this is not the video for you but if you don't mind that kind of stuff then this is the channel and the video for you so y'all let's get right into this video here is Justin Aaron singing can we talk on the voice The smoothness of his voice it's almost like a breath of fresh air how smooth and fluid his voice is it's just kind of like butter and he's not doing a lot in terms of runs things like that and that's okay he just kind of smoothing the butter on smoothing it all just I saw you start a da 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 and it's so nice and he gives me like a Luther Vandross energy vocally just kind of just I don't got to do a lot I'ma just sing and let my voice do the talking you know I love that about his voice I knew is not easy to sing and I can tell that he's really navigating and being intentional with how he's placing his voice if you notice as he went up it kind of got a little bit more twang a little bit more forward in placement if you will so I'm sure he probably brought a little bit more into his nose or be you know into the mask some people say kind of forward into the face in terms of the sensation but I'm sure he probably narrowed some things narrowed the throat a little bit and kind of brought it more nasal and forward a little bit you're gonna hear a lot more of that as the video goes too hear that the weight is kind of being lifted off the voice too as he goes higher there's less weight less depth less thickness but it's still powerful and full and i'm not saying his voice doesn't have weight you can just tell that the sound has shifted up and forward as he's singing this going up into this chorus and things like that go that O was a hard vowel to sing but instead of going go he went go and kind of brought it more forward and kind of twingy go then oh please and had a growl at the oh please a little squall I'll say not a growl more it's like a little squall oh please so he really kind of brought it forward bright brought that squall in there and that oh please and he's really opening up those vowels you can see that mouth oh please okay Now you see he didn't reach up, he didn't do none of that. He placed it, I bet you those torso muscles are right in there. He placed it, go, and he really eased into it. So I really feel like his breathing muscles and his abs, obliques, all those muscles were in there. Because if you look at his torso, that torso is very still and he's here. The only reason I know that for is because I do this when I sing too. I'll use my torso and use our breathing muscles to really anchor in, but not do a lot here and reach up and things like that. I really try to keep it stabilized here. And he's using those neck muscles too to help stabilize his singing right here too. And he brought that twang in. Go! So he really brought that twang in there, that narrow area of the sphincter a little bit. Kind of brought some nasality in there. And he really opened up and let it go. He also didn't hold back. He uh, eased into it and relaxed into it. Though he was still using those breathing muscles and still being intentional with how he used his voice, he still relaxed into it because he trusted himself. He trusted the gift. He trusted his voice. He trusted his technique. And I think that's a great combination to hit high notes or to do whatever you want to do that's a little more ambitious when you trust yourself and you trust your technique and you trust your gift. Uh, you can relax in it and go for it.
underlining squall in this whole chorus right here. So those vocal folds are probably compressing together just a little bit with the false vocal folds. <laughs> Pressing together just a little bit to really bring that underlining grit that he's singing in. Yeah. If you enjoyed this analysis, click subscribe down below to click the alert button next to it so you know when the next video is posted. And as I will always continue to say to you, be vocally bold, creative and aware, but most of all, be vocally you. All right, y'all, I'll see y'all real soon. Happy holidays.